Another day and more tensions boiling over at City Hall. Council divided over how to handle allegations of bullying and threats by one of their own members. WGN political reporter Jamon Bradley live outside City Hall tonight. Hi, Jamon. Hi, Mike and Ray. There was important business on the agenda here at City Council today. But first, the Alders had to address allegations of bullying and intimidation. I felt like I was back in the South. 68-year-old Emma Metz, who was born in Arkansas, speaking for the first time since what she calls a highly uncomfortable encounter with Carlos Ramirez Rosa outside last Thursday's special city council meeting. He said, you know, you shouldn't be in here. I said, well, why are you bothering me? He says, because the rest of your colleagues are idiots. Witnesses accused Ramirez Rosa of intimidating Mitz, blocking her from entering the meeting. Now, I don't know what manhandling and how people said it, but it was more of, you can't go into this meeting. Where I was literally blocked at that door, it was unbecoming of anyone who's elected to represent people. During Metz's emotional remarks, Black Caucus colleagues stood in a show of support. You shouldn't be talked to, dismissed, or deminimized. No form way. Never let your position take over you. Next, it was Ramirez Rosa's turn. I rise to apologize to my colleague, Alderwoman Emma Metz, to all of my colleagues, to this council, for my actions last week, Thursday. Thursday's special meeting was chaotic, tensions were high. I dramatically overreacted to the intensity of what was happening in that meeting. And there's no excuse for that. Ramirez Rosa is also accused of threatening to block zoning for other council members. I also apologize to Alderwoman Nicole Lee, Alderman Felix Cardona, Alderman Chris Taliaferro, Alderman Desmond Yancey for my disrespectful words and actions. I'm deeply sorry. When a handful of people in the gallery booed, Mitz walked over to Ramirez Rosa and hugged him. With Ramirez Rosa stepping down as Mayor Johnson's floor leader and chairman of the powerful zoning committee, the council will try to move past the incident. Before today's regular city council meeting, more fireworks when the rules committee convened. But the chairwoman put the meeting on hold after angry spectators shouted down members debating welcoming migrants. The meeting is recessed until Thursday. At this time, please exit through the back door. Alderman Scott Wegesback offered a motion to censor Ramirez Rosa. A, a council vote ended in a tie. So when that happens, the vote goes to the mayor to break the tie. And in this instance, the mayor voted against censure. Live tonight from City Hall, Tamon Bradley, WGN News. All right, Tamon, thank you.